Folks in Nampa worry about the future of education for students in the troubled school district. The district says more than 100 teachers left their job since the final bell last school year. Napa school district leaders say 151 employees have resigned. Many of those leaving their positions are teachers. Mike Sharp joins us live in the studio with tonight's big story. Don, the Nampa Education Association tells me there was no concerted effort of teachers resigning in mass, and each teacher had their own reasons for leaving. I got one teacher's story as she packed up her classroom for the last time. It's really hard to to walk away from that and to pack away everything. It's um, you, you feel like you're kind of you know leaving a part of your life, leaving a part of your family in a big way. Former Columbia High School teacher Kate Baker is packing up her classroom for the final time. She's one of 151 district employees who have recently resigned, and she's heading to Meridian School District to become a librarian. We all care about what we do so much that we made it work, and we made it work, and we made it work, and we keep making it work. At a certain point, you begin to wonder how much further it can go. Baker says each teacher leaving the district is doing so for different reasons. But for her, she said she didn't feel stable in the cash strap district, especially with a new baby. I had a baby last spring, and I have to think about the fact that I need to be able to provide for my family. The Nampa School District website has more than 70 jobs posted, many of those for teachers. Teachers, Baker says, will be hard to replace. I do think it's a tragedy that so many teachers are leaving, and I know I'm contributing to that. She says she hopes parents of her students will understand why so many teachers teachers resigned or retired this year, but she says the signs have been pointing toward a massive loss of teachers for years. I think we've all seen the exodus coming for a while. There's been a lot of talk over the last few years of how much longer can we keep doing this, how much longer. I honestly, sadly, expect the number to be higher. The school district says they typically see about 5% of the workforce leave between school years, but the 151 employees leaving the district will mean more than an 18% turnover this year. Live in studio, I'm Mike Sharp. Today's 6 on your side.